Hi guys, Optimistic for gshelper.com and in today's video I'm going to take you through adjusting your projects that you've been working on in older versions of Game Salad to the new version of Game Salad that supports the iPhone 5 screen size. So I'm going to show you two possible solutions, um, one using a portrait based proje project and the other using a landscape based project for a portrait project what I've done is I've created a scene rules actor and this is an unlocked instance of the actor so once I open it up and I would have clicked unlock I created a new rule and I call it my resize rule and I did as follows if attribute device screen size the height of it is equal to 568 then I'm, I drop three change attribute behaviors in there and the first one I'm adjusting is the current scene camera size height to 568 then I'm adjusting the current scene camera size width to 378 and the origin, the camera's origin, I'm adjusting current scene, camera, origin, x to negative 29. Now what it does is that it gives me uh, a few extra pixels of space to the top of my game. So now all, what I have chosen to do is create a larger background image to just take up that extra space. I can give you a quick preview of it to see. So this is what uh, you will see on like the iPhone and iPhone 4S, this current view here. Um, but on the iPhone 5, when you go to crop, you will see a longer version of the background. So from the area right above the star here, I've added as an additional background. And for the actual gameplay area, <coughs> any space, anything above this dotted line is what you'll see on the iPhone 5. So I've just chosen to add more to the top of the game. And that's uh, portrait projects. With regards to landscape projects, however, I think this solution is, is a bit easier. It's pretty much the same um, procedure, creating an unlocked instance of an actor on the scene. And this time we're changing the, the once the device screen size width is equal to 568 then we adjust the scene camera size height to 378 and we adjust the scene camera origin Y to negative 29 now what this will do is it will sort of compress everything so you will have sorry some volume in that. You won't have um, to add any additional graphics. So this is it in regular portrait mode, in, in landscape mode and legacy. And uh, if we were to go to iPhone landscape, crop, everything is displayed nice and neat uh, and not too stretched. So this is our quick solution for portrait and landscape projects using the updated version of Game Salad that uh, caters to the iPhone 5 resolution. Thanks again and we look forward to bringing you more videos. Bye bye.